success is the progressive realization of a worthy ideal. I'm gonna show you how great I am. What up guys, in this one we're going to talk about the L part in the simple leadership model and this is very important because leadership is a matter of the heart. So we're here we're talking about love. Leadership is a matter of the heart and you need to love absolutely what it is that you're doing. The greatest analogy you can think of in terms of leadership is that of being a parent and a parent wants more for their children than they could ever achieve for themselves. So when things go wrong, what are you going to do? Fire your children. I know sometimes you want to, but that's not gonna happen. You would want them to, you I want them to learn, to grow, and to succeed. So, uh, so leadership is is a matter of love, and there are different levels uh, to love, and the different love languages. I'm talking to you different levels of love. Some people love uh, just because they have to. It's just a situation that they're in, and they have to love the person, with a family member, with a friend. They just love just because they have to. And then others love because whether or not the person returns that love, yes or no, it doesn't actually matter. But they're still going to love them and still going to care for them and the next level of love is irregardless of whether this person hurts you or not you are still going to show them love because that's who you are and that's what you uh, that's what you actually love and that's what you actually are and leader the best leaders are those people who express this uh, the expression of, of love and what you have to understand is that love is the center. love is the center of leadership. That means I will be there for you. I will return your call, your calls. I will serve you the best way that I can. I will discipline you when necessary so that you can actually grow. I will tell you whenever it is that you're wrong, even though other people will not be willing to tell you the truth. I'm going to be a person to tell you the truth to your face, and that is what this, the essence and the heart of leadership is. Because as a leader, you want the other person to become better, not because you want them to conform to what your idea of better is maybe but you want them to reach their highest ideal and to become as successful as, uh, as you can and as a as a person who's in in love with their cause and the purpose and love with the people that you are with you need to be able to show them that you that you care you need to be able to show them that you care you need to listen to them you need to give them the, the time of day and when they complain and when there's something that's going wrong with them in their lives don't just dismiss it and even if it's inconvenient to you and it's going to help you to, it's going to cause you to get out of your own way be sure that you are actually listening to them and actually showing them that that you actually care and you need to be able to love what you do wholeheartedly remember that success is the progressive realization of the way the idea and if you are doing work that you do not love wholeheartedly and that does not mean necessarily that you are going to enjoy the work that you're going to do every single day there are going to be times when you're not going to enjoy going and going and you're not going to enjoy it but you actually <laughs> but it's still something that you believe in and you're passionate about and you're loving it doing it wholeheartedly then that love and that enthusiasm becomes infectious and it, it will help help you help your followers to know that they can trust you because you love the work that you're doing, doing and that if you demand a high standard of yourself and a high standard of them it's not coming from a place of malicious intent but because you love wholeheartedly what you do and then uh, you want them to love wholeheartedly what it is that, as it is that they do and then another thing is important for you to is to promote positive work I mean how easy is it to get up in the morning when you know that you're not doing the best that you can it's not very it's not very easy you just lie in bed and just say oh let me just sleep a couple of more minutes because it's not going to matter but it does matter it does matter but how easy is it for you to get up in the morning when you know you're going to do positive work that is purposeful and that is meaningful and that you understand is going to change the world you can't wait to get up in the morning because you a positive work is being promoted so that as a leader try to do your best for you to find out what the values of your employees are and for you to promote positive work for them. And as another note on, on love, love is hard, love is painful, uh, but it's patient and it is kind and you have to love on a consistent and a daily basis and if you love someone and you love what you uh, what what you're doing sometimes whether you feel like uh, you're expressing that love or not doesn't actually matter because you're actually committed to the cause so being a leadership is a matter of the heart if you don't really care about the people that you're serving the people that you're leading and the work that you're doing 
then you, you can't really be the best leader that's out there possible and you know and you, you you've met people who are in a job just for the sake of being a job who are in a position for the sake of being a position but they do not love the cause and do not love their people and that is just a travesty because you're going to be wasting time so remember that leadership is a matter of the heart and that success is the progressive realization of a worthy idea be the day that turns your life around. All you need is a reason to turn you on. The day my life changes. Now who can do that? Anybody. When can you do it? Whatever day you pick.